Here's how you print using Papercut on any library computer. Press Ctrl Alt Delete to get the login screen if you don't already see it. Then type in your Wustlekey credentials and hit Enter. When you have something you want to print, click on the File menu and click Print. The default printer is Wulib Print and you should leave it as it is as long as you are picking up your print in the library. If you instead send your print job to the Wustle Print Queue, you may pick it up at the library, residential halls, and many other locations across the Danforth and Medical School campuses. Don't be concerned if you see an error message when you choose a printer. It should not affect your print job. Here, since I'm printing in the library, I'm going to leave it on the default Wulib Print printer. If you're printing in portrait orientation, black and white, double-sided, you don't need to change anything else. If you do need to change any of those settings, click on the Printer Properties or Printing Preferences link. If your print is in color and you want to print in color, click on the Color tab and deselect Print in Grayscale. To print on one side only, click on the Finishing tab and deselect Print on both sides. To print in Landscape, also under the Finishing tab, in the Orientation box in the lower right hand side, you can choose Landscape Orientation. Click OK and Print to send your print to the queue. To help protect your Wustle key and other private information, don't forget to exit your program. Save your work. and log off from the library workstation you are using if you don't plan to return to it soon. Now go to the nearest printer. If it appears to be turned off, touch any key to awaken it. Swipe your ID card to log in. You can swipe either side of your card, but you do have to place the card in the card reader heads down. If you don't have your ID card handy or want to type in your Wustle key information instead, touch the username field and you'll get an on-screen keypad. Type your Wustle key, click OK, tap on the password field, type your password, and click OK again. Now, in the Print Release box in the lower left-hand corner, choose Release Pending Jobs. If you've sent more than one print, touch the name of the one you want to print and click on Print. Click on OK to return to the main menu. Account selection is in the upper left-hand corner of the screen. If you have more than one account, you can choose which to use here. Your quota is used first, then funds from your Campus Card account. When you're finished, don't forget to sign out here in the lower right-hand corner.